Hi, I'm Sanudharan from Monks Music Academy. I'm going to show you a very simple trick to cut your noise using an inbuilt plugin of the software called Reaper. So I'm going to show you uh, my screen. Suppose you have uh, imp already imported some uh, plenty of the tracks and one of one among that have the noise issue or you may not, uh, you might be uh, like mastering or you might be doing some editing in a movie track or a soundtrack, a short film track, whatever it is. Uh, first, let's import this. So I'm going to import a track which have lots of noise. Uh, yeah, so I will, I'm importing that. So maybe this is, suppose this is uh, your track. So we, you can hear it. <laughs> Lots of noise, lots of noise. See, some places even, yeah, this is starting. So, you have to find a place which the main instrument uh, which contain noise is silent. In this case, we have the guitar all around. So, yeah, some places guitar is silent, only the noise is audible. Now it should be a uh, constant, yeah, most of the time. So you have to uh, insert a plugin called. So you have to search here all plugins. Yeah, Ray F Ray Fair. It's a FFT EQ dynamic processor. Uh, it's in built uh, plugin. So I just open it. Okay, R E A F I R Ray Fair. You can say that. And you have to make sure that uh, the mod is uh, subtract, yeah, and it's automatic should be setting to automatic, and uh, yeah, this is uh, smooth. You can do that point smooth, okay. Then the FFT size, it's better to do it one zero two four, yeah, or uh, the two zero four a whatever you want. So that's two one zero two four. Yeah, now we are ready to analyze the noise, and all you have to do play the place which have only content noise not the entire track so you can actually toggle the the repeat button on and let's play it <laughs> see the noise has been captured without this the noise is like now some of the guitar is also captured when i switch it off the automatic stuff off yeah, you have to off it first they let it analyze and uh, let it fix the subtraction it's it will subtract that kind of frequency definitely it's going to affect a little bit of your sounding now let's play the guitar portion and let's hear it no noise it will affect it yeah with the loud portion it won't have it won't much effective with the whole track you can switch it on and off this was the horrible noise you can actually alter by dragging this yeah we have to automatic first let us do the automatic analysis yeah then you can do some alteration by clicking here, this side okay so we can do it. See, you can also also do some alterations. So it's better or worse. This is the best place. So click here and automatic. And now uh, the settings you should remember. And you can edit from just clicking and dragging. So you can adjust your EQ according to your taste. And you can adjust it uh, in, a, in a smooth way, which might be good. Okay, I hope you guys understand. So the noise uh, should be avoided while recording, but if it's happened somehow, if it's not unavoidable, you have to do this. Use this uh, pretty precious tool. I say that because I like this very much. Um, yeah, it's a high quality tool to reduce your noise.